Okay, so across the line we go. We're into the source hairpin, down into second gear. Quite an early turn in, maximise all the apex curb and hard on the power to maximise the exit curb as well. Nice clean exit on the run down to Eau Rouge, nice and smooth up through the gearbox. Looking into the apex on the left hand side, maximise the entry curb on the left, minimise, minimise the steering through the right and full power over the curb on the left hand side, trying to straighten off the steering as quickly as you possibly can flat out on the run all the way down into Lake Coombe. Be looking at the apex before you break. Down into third gear now, a little bit of traffic ahead of us. Use the apex curb on the right, a little bit of throttle before you turn left. Balance the throttle through the left apex. Compromised on an early turn in apex. Use all the exit curb here. Now down into Rivage, turn the car in first as you brake, so go in nice and early. Bring the car out slightly, be gentle to pick the power back up, I'm a little bit too aggressive there. Use all the track on the left, all the track on the right, try to just lift off here. Big apex curb, hard on the throttle, use all the exit curb there as well, you'll find more time. Down into Puon as well, you want to try and reduce the brake pressure as much as you can. Really, really light on the brakes, smooth turn in, keep the car really balanced, wait for it to grip back up. Now don't come back to this apex, minimise the steering lock through there. Looking into the apex again, same sort of corner as Lake Coombe. Balancing the throttle now, turn the car in, try to squeeze the power between the two apexes. Now use all the exit curb here again. Fantastic, all the way to the left hand side. Soft brake, gently turn the car in, use all the apex, probably a bit too much there. Now flat out through Stabler if possible, maximise the exit, use all the track on the left hand side. Now through this section you want to try and keep the car as stable and as flat as possible, middle of the road all the way through. Try not to add steering lock where you don't have to. You see that I'm not quite making the apex on the left, I'm running the car all the way to the right. Now into Blanchemont, flat out, early part of the apex curb, run all of the exit curb as well. Now into the last corner of the circuit, into the chicane, hard on the brakes down to second gear. Off the brake really early, let the car freewheel first of all. Half throttle as you turn in, lift off round the apex, full power for the exit. Use all the curb on the left hand side. Now on this particular lap, have a listen of the throttle application through Eau Rouge. On the entry I get a little bit crossed up on the way into the source just there. I get a nice exit though, now we'll be flat out 100% throttle all the way through Eau Rouge. Keep the car as stable as you possibly can. As you can see, I'm maximising the four curbs all the way through the corner as you go through. It's very, very rewarding once you've done it and you come out with a big old grin on your face. Okay, so on to the brakes, down into Lake Coombe. We're down to third gear. You're looking at the apex all the way through. Off the brake early. Don't touch the power till you're turning back to the left. A little bit of lift through the left. Don't use all the track on the right or the left-hand side. Early turn, wide exit curb. See we're caught up by a little bit of traffic just here in front of us. You'll see me starting to go in fairly early. Try to V-shape off this corner. Be smooth, smooth, smooth on the throttle on the way out. Not ideal conditions at this circuit at this current time. Slightly damp. See that we missed the apex to just give the car on the left a little bit more space. Now again on the run down to pull on soft brake pressure. Got a yellow flag, so I'm having to back off. Now we've got two cars in front. Try to think ahead of yourself as to what you're going to do with two cars. Where are they going to go? They're going to go left, so I'll go right. And the quicker car, best places to overtake them up the inside. Now again, off the brake. Balance the power now, because we can't go in quite as fast because we're compromised on the entry. Now we can start to really attack and pick our lap time back up. Looking straight into the apex as we brake. Try not to use too much exit curb, that's probably about max all you want to use. Not so bad there, flat out through Stavlo again. That's too much apex curb there, you see it slightly kicked the car around, so just minimise the amount you take through that section. Again, keep the steering as smooth as you can through here, keeping the high speed up. Early part of the apex at Blanchemont. 
100% throttle. If you do need to lift, try and lift slightly in the middle of the corner, not on entry. 